Behold, tape. Yes, tape. But where did it come from? Meet Richard Drew, born in Minnesota in 1899. Before he found work with 3M in 1923, Richard was best known as a banjo player. Back in those days, 3M wasn't the giant corporation it is today. It only manufactured sandpaper. While testing a new brand of sandpaper at a local auto body shop, Richard noticed something interesting. The auto painting crew had a tough time making a clean dividing line between two color paint schemes. This gave Richard an idea, mm. and in 1925, he invented the world's first masking tape. But masking tape wasn't an immediate hit. The auto painters were disappointed by his first prototype. In fact, they told him to send the product back to his bosses, whom they said were too scotch or cheap to add enough adhesive. Yet Richard persisted, and masking tape was eventually a success. And he didn't stop there. In 1930, Richard invented a waterproof, transparent tape used to seal insulation bats in railway refrigerator cars, which were used to transport food. As the Great Depression set in, people quickly found that this clear tape could be used for many other purposes, including temporarily mending clothes. Nowadays, Richard's tapes are commonplace in homes and businesses around the world. That joke about the scotch stuck around too, and today we know this brand as scotch tape.